no one is coming to rescue us. Welcome back to our channel, Cinema, Cinema Brothers. Brothers. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and namaskar, namaskar to, to all of you. Today we are going to react to Gerald Butler's latest movie trailer, Kandahar. Before we go any further, don't forget to smash the subscribe button, like and share, and do comment down below. In three, two, one, go. What's the job? We're gonna destroy their whole nuclear program. Breaking news exposing the CIA sabotage of Iran's nuclear reactor. Really for 15 minutes. So he's basically CIA. He's an old CIA base in Kandahar. Kandahar. Just want to go home, and I'll be with you. Oh, 400 miles. The distance is not the main issue. It's what's in between. I didn't even catch my guys. Great action. We'll sell them to the highest bidder. No one is angel. coming to rescue us. It's a lot of buttons. Is that like We have nice. to get to Kandahar. Oh, oh. Get down! Oh. Oh, nah. Bro. Kandahar. May 26. May 26. So that was the trailer for that was very Gerard nice. Butler's Kandahar, Kandahar. his latest movie. Really so what good is the VFX though? Really good. You know, while 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 um well before we before I watched this, I actually thought this would be a low budget movie. Yeah. Since I searched up the cast on this movie on this, on this movie trailer thingy, right? And I found that there were only 15 people in the cast, yeah. and that's yeah. very low. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and I mean, you can see that the the, the movie before uh, Plane it was actually also a low budget movie with yeah. very few cast and. But as long as there's Gerard Butler in there, then because he he does great action too, even at this age, because yeah. like he start he like he's he's been playing movie, movies for a long time now, and he still does these type of action movies, where it's really good to see him doing all this stuff. Yeah, and the VFX was really good as well. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh uh, um, with also also the action action scene job, but the history. His first major movie was called Phantom of the Opera, mm -hmm. released yeah. in two thousand four. Yeah, yeah, but he was but he became more famous uh, in the movie Three Hundred. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So like he started around the nineteen their late nineteen nineties, and then he started getting these roles where he would actually. Um, like start advancing I and like making get, getting better roles as uh like as his, in his acting career mm -hmm. and yeah, then like, that I think, was it wasn't it wasn't his first movie like um Mrs Brown or something Mrs Brown yeah yeah like Mrs Brown but like but he played he played like a small role in that mm -hmm. I don't know if you just search it up you can see it says Mrs Brown mm -hmm. and then it just says Gerard Butler's first film debut yeah after 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 he did the movie 300 he got a lot of like good film offers. yeah because that was his break point mm -hmm. later on he started getting the he um played he played in the um the fallen franchise with um with Morgan Freeman yeah, yeah and he also had uh, like before that he also had 300 right we talked about that mm -hmm. yeah. where um he like he's very there's some very iconic scenes there this, you know, this I kind of I kind of I kind of looked at the trailer the same way I would watch um uh, the fallen, the fallen franchise. Mm -hmm. Since you can see in the fallen franchise, there's always, there's always a problem that he has to get out of, and a, a problem that he has to uh, challenge and um, um, uh, you yeah. know, accomplish and stuff yeah. like that, right? Um, in this trailer, you can see that uh, somehow, like, people start like, oh my, he's an agent, right? He's basically an agent, and he gets yeah, caught. Yeah. He gets caught in like a, I think it's during a big mission or something like that. Mm. Yeah. His cover gets blown. Yeah, his cover mm. is blown since he was undercover. Yeah. Yeah. yeah his cover is blown, and then the the I think the the, the local army or the local uh, authorities start um, chasing him and. We Kandahar. Kandahar is in Afghanistan, right? So yeah. this is during like this is during the um like the war in Afghanistan that they're talking about. Right now. And uh, also in the trailer, it, it just said like it was a CIA. Kandahar was just a CIA base. I wonder what like what like Kandahar is like. Uh, I wanted to know more information about Kandahar. Mm -hmm. Like, was it like a protection shelter, mm -hmm. or like um, yeah? 
And I also want to talk about like a negative point. I think they should have added like not just Gerard because you only see Gerard Butler here. They should add like one or two more like really um, famous actors. I think that would draw more attention to the movie. Yeah, I also saw that. Yeah, almost in every scene, other other than the far shots and then the wide angles. Yeah, you can see that every every in every shot, the Friend. only face that was there Gerard, was with yeah with Gerard, Gerard Butler, Butler yeah. along with um, one or two. Um, uh, uh, supporting cast yeah, yeah. yeah. and uh, when I was looking at the cast I also saw um, Ali Faisal mm -hmm. the last last mo uh, Hollywood movie we saw him in was Death in the Nile right? Death in the yeah. Nile yeah. Yeah. yeah that was and his most recent movie, movie. Yeah, I'm, get I'm yeah. guessing he's pretty popular yeah mm -hmm. so like no. movies like when you do movies and like roles in movies like these that's how you start getting like the bigger roles because Gerard but this is how Gerard Butler started off too he did the smaller roles and then he uh, started um, doing like he started doing like the big movies yeah. and then he's he like starting land yeah yeah greenland and, uh and the last movie that we watched of gerald butler was um last, last alive. scene alive yeah where his like which wife gets the, lost which, which and he's and then he tries to find his wife it was a low budget movie i yeah. guess it was medium budget but yeah. Not... but yeah but the latest movie that that already came out was uh called plane mm -hmm. we didn't get to watch it yet so. yeah we didn't watch, we that haven't one watched yet. it yet but we have watched uh last scene alive yeah overall to sum up all of the like all of the, the the review for Kandahar and like it's um and Gerard Butler like his performance in it he did an amazing job I think I think the action was really great I wasn't expecting it to be like this because I thought exactly like you said yeah, I thought it was gonna be a low budget, budget movie and then I the explosions I, the explosion everything the cars flipping the fire everything the was, yeah everything was actually realistic um, was I, well I hope this movie gets like an award or something because of all the action and VFX. I mean, it and should like, it should at least get like a good yeah. Rating. It, it should at least uh, get like um like good ratings mm -hmm. um like I'm four stars or something. Yeah, yeah, four 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 like, three four, yeah four four, 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 five, stars. four four five four three point five yeah. So overall, to sum it all up, we think J this was a great trailer. Gerard Butler did um a great performance, he, even he, though he did amazing. Yeah, he did amazing, and we, we liked the best, action. Yeah. We liked the the music was good too, yeah, and the, the music um, was really the VFX, like, the VFX uh, it, was it, great. It made you feel like it was a thriller. Mm -hmm. It was like so. Good. so and so um, this. So the, before we, uh, this is the end of our review. Before we leave, don't forget to smash the subscribe button, like and share, and comment down below about your thoughts on this video. All the best for Rob Butler. See you guys in our next video. This is Cinema, Cinema Brothers, Brothers signing, signing off. off. I think this is the eye. <laughs>